as both public and private companies prepare for a return to the moon and the first human steps on the red planet, there is a renewed interest in keeping people alive and productive in these extreme environments. Plants, and specifically crop plants, will be an important component of regenerative proposals for vital support systems, as they provide food, oxygen, carbon dioxide exfoliating, and aid in the recycling of water all in a self-regeneration or by our regenerative fashion. Undoubtedly, plants are a requirement for any sufficiently long duration time and distance in terms of human space exploration of the mission. There has been a lot of research in this area, research that has not only advanced agriculture in space, but has led to a large number of Earth-based developments, such as LED greenhouse lighting and vertical agricultural applications. New Seed Potato Propagation Techniques a recent article by Dr. Raymond M. Wheeler from the NASA Kennedy Space Center, now available in open access at the Open Agriculture magazine, provides an informative and comprehensive account of the various historical and current international contributions for bioregenerative support of life and the use of controlled environment agriculture for human space exploration. Covering all the main news of international teams, part of this work refers to the transfer of technology that is valuable here on Earth. Research in the area began in the 1950s and 1960s through the works of Jack Myers and others, who studied algae for oxygen production and carbon dioxide removal for the United States Air Force and National Aeronautics and Space Administration NASA.